Hello viewers, today I am going to disassemble this JBL's Soundfly Air which works in the AirPlay of Apple. This speaker is made for Apple. Alright, let's start disassembling the speaker. Here the socket comes. This can be mounted in the wall outlet of the power supply. Now to disassemble the speaker, I am just opening this front panel. Just by doing like this, it will come out. You can see the driver here. Alright, now to open this, we have to remove this made of silicon rubber. I am going to remove this. Below this, the screws are there. Then there are 8 screws. I am going to remove all 8. So this is the looking inside of the airplay. So this section is the power supply. This gives the 12 volt output to the motherboard here. So the input of this power supply is 220 volts or maybe in the US it is 110 volts. Here it is 220 and this is the feather touch on off switch for the airplay connection this switch works for that as well and i'm not sure what is the use of this usb um, it is not used for playing the song or uh, connect this is for some other purpose i'm not sure what is that you have to look at the user manual now let's open the motherboard here i'm going to remove the speakers from this side there are two screws This is the speaker driver. This is very big in size. I think it is more than one and a half or two inches. Yeah, this is two inches in size. So these two speakers are of two inches. This produces very loud and nice, clear, crisp sound. All right. Now it's time to open the motherboard here. There are four screws here. I'm just going to open that I'm removing this socket this is the power supply socket this is the antenna for Wi-Fi now I'm going to Now I am taking out this motherboard, you can see, it is very complicated. This was very expensive when this was launched, I think this is this was around rupees 10,000. So there is one more board here, you can see here, inside, inside the speaker. Actually that is a switch, here there is nothing, it is just touch the plastic here plastic body if you touch the plastic body that it works as a sensor switch this switch is for wi-fi and this is for on off button this is for wi-fi pairing all right this is the power supply as i said earlier this takes 220 input from wall outlet this is the in from here it converts 220 ac to 12 volt dc here this goes to motherboard here all right that's it in this video 
all right thanks for watching the video if you like the video please do like share subscribe to audio 360 and hit that notification bell icon and write the comment in the comment section below thanks for watching bye